Hello everyone. Um, hi again. I am Dr. Molina Patel from Akanksha Hospital, and I am an infertility specialist and uh, practicing gynecologist here. Uh, today, I will be speaking a little about PGD, that is pre-implantation genetic diagnosis. Uh, in simple words, this video will be very useful for all those couples who have had, you know, uh, the first bonds born of some or the other genetic condition. and now they are very apprehensive about having a second healthy child or they are carrying some condition and now they want to ensure that they have a healthy baby uh, so from the time that a couple gets to know that they are pregnant uh, the only thing that they aim for is to have a healthy baby and this momentous decision of getting pregnant becomes very stressful for all those couples who are at a risk or whose prospective kids are at a risk of developing some or the other genetic hereditary condition so when such a couple comes to us what are the various options that we provide with them the most important thing that we help them with is pgd which is called pre implantation genetic diagnosis now what is this pgd who needs it how do we do it which are the diseases which uh, can be detected is what we are going to talk about today so pgd is needed by all those couples Uh, in which the husband wife or both are carrying some or the other genetic condition they have had their first borns already born with some or the other genetic abnormality and or or they have some or the other abnormality running in patterns uh, in the families now uh, ivf is needed uh, you know to do this pgd uh, pgd is a part of ivf so when such a couple comes to us first of all we provide them with a detailed ivf counseling but this ivf counseling becomes a little bit more specialized in such a case because we also include a detailed genetic counseling at akanksha hospital we are very proudly associated with a very experienced genetic counselor so this genetic counselor will review all your reports you know draw necessary diagrams have a detailed consultation with uh, the couple and in this consultation they will also discuss the probabilities and the chances of passing this condition to the offspring and so on The next step is to draw the blood from the husband and the wife that will form the genetic material that is the DNA sample is needed and this is important because a customized probe will be created which is only for you to test your particular disorder then we perform the IVF that is the standard IVF protocol we undergo uh, we take the eggs from the wife we fertilize it with the husband's sperm and the embryos are created a specialized doctor called the embryologist then takes a few cells from your embryos and these are tested and sent to the lab against the specific probe that was already created for you beforehand and in this way we can differentiate which of the embryos are affected with the disease in question and which of them are disease free and the disease free healthy embryos can be transferred in the womb of the mother and she can carry and she can become pregnant to a baby who is not carrying the disease in question uh the success rate of pgd is as high as 96 to 98% but always when the woman gets pregnant even after a transfer of an healthy embryo antenatal screening that is screening for the disease while she is pregnant is always advocated and you can discuss it with your treating obstetrician it can be in the form of blood tests free fetal dna testing or ultrasound even invasive testing can be done and so on so the options are very uh, very many um now which are the diseases which are uh, which can be detected in this pgd so the list is endless but just to name a very few so in india thalassemia is so common particularly in our part of this panchmal dang district in gujarat so 3 to 4% of babies are born with thalassemia major so thalassemia if the husband and wife both are thal minor you can have a kid using pgd technology who is free who is at the most not having the major disease it can be a carrier state or a normal condition and uh, uh, there are other conditions like cystic fibrosis uh, inclusion body disorder uh, you know there's uh, spinal muscular atrophy and so on at akanksha hospital we are very proud to say that we have the expertise and the experience to have done some really good cases using this technology we have detected the cole a4 gene mutation also very recently albinism for an indian origin couple living in africa and um, also hereditary inclusion body myopathy has been detected and so on so uh, to leave all these technical things aside the last take home message that i would that i would like to give all those anxious couples out there is that pgd is the example a classic example of technology to the rescue 
um it is it is a great modality for all those couples who are very anxious uh with respect to whether or not their baby will have the disease condition in that they are carrying or their first born is carrying so there is a light at the end of the tunnel if you have such a case scenario with you approach us you can even video call us or even send us your uh, case in an email and we can arrange a private consultation with you and we can work out your uh, cycle and make sure that you have a healthy baby